Hi, this is Sylvia, and um, I started to do the video just now, and then I decided to just stop and start over again. I'm feeling a little bit like I'm not sure what's gonna come out of my mouth, but I'm just still gonna do this video regardless, and um, with, with take imperfect action. Um, but today I wanted to talk about um, something that came up for me a couple times this week. Um, so for one thing, um, I. I um, did a post, a social media post. I don't think I posted on Facebook, but I did on Instagram and also in my private Facebook group, Quietly Ambitious and Aligned. And it was about, hi, Lizanne, it's good to, good to see you. I'm gonna try to wave at you if I can. Um, it, it, the post was about um, cultivating, oh, good. Yes, that's good. Yes, you did catch me live. And I'm not sure what's gonna come out of my mouth, but um, it's about abundance. Um, and abundance is something that I've, I'm cultivating in my life um, because I really um, am tired of having the idea that there isn't enough to go around. Um, you know, the, having the abundant mindset really is that there, there's more than enough to go around. And when one person receives things, it doesn't mean that, you know, now there's not enough for this other person. And what I've noticed this past week was that I received some things that weren't expected for me. Um, someone sent, sent me money that um, I had no expectation of getting, um, and it felt uncomfortable to me, although I was able to work through it. And then um, yesterday I got a massage and um, I asked my masseuse if she could massage me for an hour and 15 minutes because I was feeling particularly tight and she was able to do that, um, but at the end, she said she was only gonna charge me for an hour, and I noticed that it took me, like I was, I was still giving her the money for an hour and 15 minutes, and I had to kind of, had to be uncomfortable and be able to take a step back and just receive you know, the gift that she wanted to give me, which was to have me only pay for an hour. Um, she, wanted, she wanted to do the extra time. Um, and I noticed it, I'll just say, I noticed it one more time actually when I came home after the massage and I noticed that, um, you know, we're, I was paying the babysitter that was watching my daughter and my daughter happened to take my money and give her an extra $2 tip, which um, I don't know, she just did. And I wanted to, um, and after she did it, I was like, yeah, that's great. And the babysitter um, had the hardest time receiving that money. You know, she. She tried to give it back several different times, even though, even when I said, um, you know, this is important, I want you to take it. Um, and so, you know, helping others. Hi, Denise, it's good to see you. It was also good to see, talk to you the other day. Um, you know, helping others is really important and it's, and it's a part of having an abundant mindset, but the skill of receiving is just as important as well. And it's one that I think many women struggle with. Um, you know, it can feel greedy to receive. It can feel, um, maybe it feels like you're, you're not deserving to receive. Um, maybe it seems like you're, you're taking up too much space if you're receiving or you're taking away from someone else or that you, yeah, I think it's greediness too. Like we, we just think that, yes, you agree with that? We just think that we're being greedy for accepting and receiving and taking up. Um, and maybe that's, that we're not supposed to do that. And the fact is that if you, if you believe that, that we live in an abundant world and that there is plenty for all, then it's important that you also be able to receive and really open up your heart and your brain or whatever it is to just accepting and receiving. Um, and that could mean money, you know, it could mean love, it could mean connection, any of those things, energy. Um, because when we get uncomfortable with receiving, what we're saying is that um, there's not enough to go around and that we shouldn't be getting. And then how are we supposed to feel abundant if we feel like we don't deserve it or that by receiving we're taking it away from someone else or doing something wrong so i want you to pay attention to that in your own life and also notice you know over the next week or so how you react to receiving things and receiving could be you know anything from money to love um, to a compliment 
um, something like that. Are, are you someone that um, you know can receive receive a compliment and accept it, even if it feels uncomfortable, and say thank you, or are you someone who brushes it off? And I think for a long time I was someone who brushed it off, and I'm getting to be someone who accepts it, even if it's uncomfortable. And I'm going to share just one last story that I have. Hey, Amy, it's good to see you. Um, when I was 17, I remember I was about 17 years old and I was working at a, um, I was just volunteering at a dance performance and I was helping to run the concession stand and the money wasn't going to me anyhow, it was going to the ballet company. Um, but this, this person came and he bought something and then I gave him his change and it was 25 cents and he wanted to give it back. Like he said, I don't need this, I want to donate it. and. I couldn't accept it. Like I probably spent a few minutes back and forth with him, <laughs> not accepting the money. It felt that uncomfortable. I'm not sure why, but um, it felt really uncomfortable. And that memory came back to me this past week when I was thinking about it because um, there wasn't anything wrong with him wanting to, 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 to put extra money in. I wasn't stealing the money from him, he was willingly giving it. And I just wasn't comfortable receiving it. Um, and maybe I thought that there was something wrong with that. Um, but I don't longer think that. And um, I want to encourage you to think that too. Um, there are a few people watching. Um, I'm wondering, do you have any um, thoughts around this or um, around receiving and around abundance? or any comments around it. If you do, I'll just wait for a moment. Um, you know, abundance is something that I, um, I desire. Um, and I think I feel it in a, in a lot of ways. And then other times it just, it's, you know, I go drop into scarcity mindset. And, you know, I think just noticing that and then recognizing, you know, I, I, I can, that you can expand your thinking again. and that um, maybe you don't even have to try so hard, um, that it is possible. So I, I, get, no, so, um, I don't see any comments here, um, so I'm gonna stop in a minute, but I thank you so much for watching this. And um, if you watch this and you have comments around this, um, please let me know and, or put them in the comments. Um, and pay attention this coming week to how you receive and also to what it is that you're feeling when you receive. And if it's discomfort, I want you to question that. Because there is more than enough for everyone. I'm Sylvia DeMott and you can find me at sylviademott.com. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Have a great day.